I call them the three Bs, right? So super simple, right? Three Bs. First is be thoughtful. And what I mean by that is we really do need to think through the smallest and maybe the easiest, lowest hanging fruit to tackle, right? If you're teaching your child how to ride a bike, you're not going to throw them on a bike, shove them down a hill, and hope that they succeed. That doesn't make any sense. You're going to take them into your garden, you're going to take them into your driveway, put a helmet on them. In my case, my kids got knee pads and elbow pads too, just in case. Uh, and we're going to teach them. We're going to stay with them. We're going to follow them through their learning process. AI is no different. Choose a data problem and then stick with it, right? Do something that's small enough to be meaningful, but not large enough that it actually causes indecision. There's an interesting balance there. Right? So small enough to be meaningful, but not so big that you can't go forward. The second thing, so be thoughtful is to start. The second thing is to be secure. In an IT, we all know this. Security is more important today than it ever has been. And in AI, I can't stress the importance of building this into your process at the beginning. So as you're thinking through what data challenge you even want to go after, security needs to be at the forefront. And there's multiple levels, right? It's not just securing your hardware, although that's incredibly important. In AI, you have to secure your data and you have to secure your model. And what I mean by that is how do you ensure, as you're going through your data collection phase, that it's the data that you need, want, and is appropriate for what you're building, and that no one can insert false positives, or false training data that could skew your output. But then on the model side, once you've built that model, how are you ensuring no one's tampering with it? They're not changing your weights. They're not changing how that model behaves with a certain input and skewing your output. Security has never been more important in technology. And in AI, it's at the utmost of importance. So be thoughtful, be secure, and be transparent. And I'm going to cheat a little bit because there's a few <laughs> levels to transparency. Um, but transparency is about your data to begin with. So there's a ton of conversations around ethics right now. And they're all very valid. You know, the world is incredibly nuanced. It's going to be the same within this space. But what I mean by transparency of your data is by knowing what's really going into your models. And it's interesting, we recently participated in a study that looked at a number, hundreds of customers that have implemented AI at some level, some POCs, some full deployments. And we asked, how many of you have trained your AI practitioner on ethics? There were a good, a good majority of them that responded yes. But then we correlated that well, now, how many of you actually had a successful implementation? And as you can see, 92% of the companies that were successful in their implementations had trained their employees on ethics. 